The most wonderful time of the year means new challenges for local businesses. This owner of uh, this Chicago toy store tells our Tara Molina she's been forced to take holiday deliveries into her own hands. A story you'll only see on 2 Tara, it's the most popular time for toys, but they've had to change their business model. Changing your business model during the busiest time of year is no easy task, but the staff here at Building Blocks in Lincoln Park is rolling with those punches and into the parking lot. Tis the season for this toy store owner to load up her own sleigh to avoid this year's shipping and delivery delays. We can control that the shipment will get to the customer. In business here in Chicago for more than 25 years. So here we have our game wall with three stores in the city. We pride ourselves on being play experts. Uh, fidgets are really hot this year. Toy shopkeeper years. Catherine Newin told us she's never seen a holiday season like this one. So it's been incredibly hard. With cost and freight changes, she says they're no longer making money on everything in the store, with some items, including a number of the Christmas-themed toys. A lot of them are sitting on the water out, outside of Long Beach, California. We're just crossing our fingers and waiting for them to come in. As we say around here, nobody cares on the 26th. <laughs> so. The imperfect storm of supply chain issues, staff shortages, and shipping delays forcing them to eliminate a big chunk of their business. No more national shipping. They can't afford the time, risk, and possible disappointment. Which means we have to take a bit more of the um, hit in terms of our sales revenue. The holiday hits after a rough go through the pandemic. But no crying or pouting here. We're nim nimble and we're quick and improvising to recap lost revenue. Making a list, checking it twice, they'll continue to come to town to deliver toy orders themselves, as Catherine hopes their seasonal story serves as a reminder to shop in-store and small, especially now. Uh, our margins are tighter, um, and businesses like ours are you know, one season away from being threatened into extinction. All of this as national companies continue to work to hire seasonal staff. We know UPS is hiring about 1,200 seasonal workers here in the Chicago area. FedEx didn't have Chicago-specific numbers, but told us they're hiring about 90,000 people nationwide. Reporting in Lincoln Park, I'm Tara Molina, CBS2 News.